Hi guys, it's Amy here and today we're going to be looking at creating sessions, scheduling them uh, and looking at recurring sessions. So for many of you this is going to be familiar anyway because you've used it in the original format, um, in the original courses and what we were using anyway was Collaborate Ultra. So the only difference is how we get into it. So we're not going to use this join session because this will actually make us join sessions that are already running. So these are ones that have been created already and these are classes that are currently running at this moment in time. So we're going to have to go into the three dots here and choose manage all sessions. So now in here we can see sessions that have already been created and we can also see our familiar create session button. So I can go in here and create a session if I need to, give it a name, um, my newest class, if we need guest access, start date, end date, all the same settings that we had previously in Collaborate are here as well. The only um, thing that I might need to remind you of, if you decide to repeat your session and you repeat it weekly every week at the same time, you might want to delete any sessions that are in the holiday period. So I'll just hit create to get my recurring sessions uh, ready. And I'm just going to come out of it here. So this is the, the session that I had created, which is recurring, and I can go through, find all the occurrences, and then maybe find the ones that are, if they're in the October holidays, I can delete those if I need to, just by hitting delete occurrence, and that will get rid of um, that one, and if there was another one in the holidays, again, just in the three dots for the session options, and delete the occurrence, just to avoid any students that might think, for, for whatever reason, that there are some sessions over the holidays. Uh, and that's how we get into it, that's how we create our sessions, and that's how we get those recurring sessions. Again, if you've used original, uh, it will be the same um, format that you have here.